Hello and welcome back to 5 Minute Geography with me Stephen Doyle. Each week I'll be uploading a 5 minute video explaining as simply as possible the world around us. Today in this video we're going to be looking at the three orogenies or better known as mountain building periods. Stick around to the end of the video to find out a fact about mountains that you'd never believe is true. Most folding is linked with the convergent plate margins. As the plates collide the rocks are slowly compressed or squeezed together at the boundaries. The crust crumbles forming folds. These folds can range from a few centimetres across to many kilometres across. When rocks are compressed the layers that are pushed up are called anticlines and the layers that are pushed downwards are called synclines. There have been many periods of fold mountain building across the globe. These periods of mountain buildings are known as orogenies and occur because of plate tectonics. There have been three main orogenies in recent geological history. These periods include the Caledonian, the Amorican and the Alpine folding periods. The Caledonian folding period occurred approximately 450 to 400 million years ago, creating mountains that extend from Scotland to Ireland right through to North America. When the North American and the Eurasian plate collided, creating a continental and continental plate boundary. When the plates collided 450 million years ago, there followed 50 million years of folding. The pressure from the colliding plates caused layers of shale, mudstone and sandstone to buckle upwards. As the folds arched upwards, magma rose up between them and cooled forming igneous rock beneath the anticlines. The heat from the rising magma causing some of these overlying sedimentary rock to cook, turning into metamorphic rock. As the Caledonians are the oldest mountains, they are also the smallest, as weathering and erosion have worn them down. Matching folds can be traced from Greenland, Scandinavia, Scotland, the Appalachians in North America, and the Avalonian Mountains of Northwest Africa. The American folding period was the next major folding orogeny. American folding occurred 250 million years ago following a collision between the Eurasian and the African plates. The pressure came from the south as the African plate drove into the Eurasian plate. As a result these mountains have an east-west trend. American fold mountains are found in England, France and Germany as well as creating the so-called ridge and valley landscape of Munster in Ireland. The Alpine folding period, which began 40 to 60 million years ago, is still taking place today. The Alpine period refers to any mountain range created during this time. The Alps, the Himalayas, the Andes have been formed during this period. The Alps were created due to the collision of the Eurasian and the African plate. As the plates collided, the mountains grew rapidly as sandstone was buckled and folded into anticlines of more than 4,000 meters in height. The synclines between the peaks have been worn down due to glaciation over the past 2 million years, creating steep alpine valleys. The Himalayas occurred when the Indo-Australian plate collided with the Eurasian plate 500 million years ago. The Himalayas stretch over 2,400 kilometers across Pakistan, India and Nepal. The Indian continent began moving northwards 70 million years ago. The force of the collision has shortened the length of the Indian subcontinent by 2,000 kilometers and created the tallest mountains in the world. The highest peak is Mount Everest at 8,848 meters above sea level. Mount Everest continues to grow each year as the plate continues to push together. Mount Everest is growing at a rate of 2 centimeters a year, the same rate as your fingernail grows. Like the Himalayas, the Andes are growing in size each year. Other alpine folds include the Rockies in the US, Sierra Nevada in Spain and the Atlas Mountains in Northern Africa. They are the youngest mountains and therefore they are the highest because weathering and erosion has yet to break them down. So there you have it, the three major mountain building periods, the Caledonian, American, right through to the Alpine, that are still growing today at a rate of two to three centimeters a year. As always, I've been Stephen Doyle with 5 Minute Geography. Please hit the like and subscribe to the channel so you don't miss out on any future content. And if you'd like me to cover a specific topic, please just pop it in the comment section below.